Hey guys, welcome back to the Struggleville YouTube channel. I have another little quick haul video for you out of the back of my car. I went to a garage sale today, Goodwill, Salvation Army. I hope you can see the screen because I can't. It's all sunny out. It's a beautiful day today. It's like 85 degrees and not very cloudy, pretty sunny out. So it's real nice out. Um, so first I went to the garage sale. I didn't even plan to go, but it was just kind of on my way. I picked up this stapler. Um, it's a Scout number 202. I don't know, it looks anywhere from like... 5 to 20 bucks was kind of the range of them, but I thought I can list it as a fixed price and hold out. I got that and this ice crusher, which this is the third one I've had of this exact kind, exact color, exact exact same thing. Uh, I got $20 for one. I think I only got 10 for the second one, and the second one was missing that wall mount bracket in the pin there. So this one being complete, I'm hoping it's closer to the $20 side. I paid $5 for the two pieces together, so that should be fine. It was an auction at a, or auction, it was a garage sale at a farm, which was really nice. I kind of prefer those to the subdivisions and in-town ones. These are all um, coffee mugs that I bought. One of them was a Starbucks coffee mug for 49 cents. All of them were either anywhere from 25 cents to 99 cents, but I'm not actually going to sell them per se. I'm using them for a craft project I'm going to do. If that works out, I'll do a video to show you guys what I'm making with them. Um... But yeah, that's so I bought, I don't know, there's maybe 10 or 15 of them there. I got three board games, Beat the Parents, which I've sold before, Monopoly, and I'm thinking, you know, Monopoly's around so much, um, if it's not complete, I could probably sell some of the pieces out of it, and, um, I don't know, but Monopoly's probably only worth, like, five to eight bucks or something. And then Hi-Ho Cherio back there, it was 49 cents, and, um, I have, like, four or five of them there just missing some of the cherries, so I figure I can make a complete, a couple complete games maybe out of those. And I just got a few books. Not a whole lot. I was here about two weeks ago, and I didn't scan all of them. I got bored. But this one, I think it was this one. I could be wrong, but uh, the cheapest one was forty dollars, and it has a forty thousand sales rank. So I paid two dollars for that. So that kind of makes up for anything else. But it's Salvation Army, and Salvation Army stuff still in my cart here. I kind of took a swing at this, and I'm hoping it works out well. You guys can do the math, but I paid. Six ninety nine. I don't know if you can read that. Six ninety nine a piece, and I bought thirty three of these. Um, it's a plantar fasciitis foot rest holder wrap. I don't know what you call it, but anyways, um, the cheapest one on Amazon FBA. It has a nineteen thousand sales rank in like the health and beauty category, which I don't know if I've ever sold anything in the health and beauty category, or at least I haven't paid attention. So I don't know how good nineteen thousand is as a sales rank. But the cheapest one listed is $25, and that person has two left. Um, it's also like new condition. My only question is, some of these, if I can find one, are really beat up. The packages, like the item's new, but the package is like ripped, or just kind of looks beat up. And I don't know if on Amazon, if I would want to sell that as a new item or a used item with the damaged packaging. I might list some of these on eBay too, so I gotta figure out what I'm doing exactly with them. They're so light they'll go first class mail, so I'm thinking of just doing it merchant fulfilled to see how it goes. Maybe send some into, I don't know what I'm doing yet, I just bought them, but I'll have to do some research and look into it. If anyone has any suggestions on what I should do with these things, feel free to leave a uh, comment below. But I have to make a stop at Menards and then I'm done for the day. So thanks for watching guys, if you have any comments leave a comment below. Make sure to give the video a like. I hope you can see it. It's so sunny out, but this weather's awesome. I'm going to try and get as much done outside today as I can. Hopefully the weekend's just as nice. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. If you're not a subscriber, make sure to subscribe to the channel.